Are you looking for a grooming brush for your short-haired pet? Or are you tired of sofas and floors being covered in hairs? In this video, Richard Cross reviews 5 of the best dog brushes for short-haired breeds. One of the advantages of a short-haired dog breed is they are less likely to develop tangles or mats. Short coats are also less time-consuming to groom. All dogs require some grooming though. In fact, even short-haired dogs, such as Labs, Rottweilers, Beagles and Boxers, need regular brushing to stay healthy and looking their best. This is because brushing is vital for removing dirt and dust from hair fibers. It also spreads healthy oils across your dog's skin and is a great opportunity to bond. As an extra bonus, brushing with the right types of brush, more on that in a moment, can remove loose hairs. Grooming won't stop shedding completely, but it can make dog hair more manageable. After all, every hair removed by a de-shedding brush is one less on your floor or sofas. Not all dog brushes are suitable or effective for short-haired breeds though. To help you get the right brush for your pet, I've put together a list of the best brushes for short coats. Check out the description link for more info and latest price. 1. Furminator de-shedding tool. The Furminator is arguably the most well-known dog brush, and for good reason. It's an excellent de-shedding tool that does a great job of removing loose hair. The Furminator is more expensive than most brushes, but is available in several sizes and has a short hair option. If you're tired of the never-ending battle with pet hair, then a de-shedding brush is an essential purchase. These brushes remove loose hair from both the guard layer and undercoat before they can fall onto your floor. The Furminator is one of the best de-shedding tools. It's designed to gently pass through the top layer to reach the undercoat, which allows it to remove more loose hair than a bristle brush. There's also an ejector button for disposing collected hair. It's hard to describe just how much hair the Furminator can remove. Even if you think you've groomed your dog properly, you'll still end up with a big pile of loose hairs. In fact, the Furminator is so effective that you need to be careful not to overdo it. Just a few minutes of brushing each day can greatly reduce the amount of loose hair in your home. While the Furminator is great for getting rid of loose hair, it's not designed to untangle mats. For this reason, it's best to use a different brush to remove mats first. Note, there are two types of Furminator depending on hair length. Make sure you choose the short option for short-haired breeds, as it's designed for coats that are less than 2 inches in length. Check out the description link for more info and latest price. 2. LA Beauty Labs Bristle Brush the LA Beauty Labs Bristle Brush is a great option for general grooming. The boar bristles make it effective at removing debris while leaving a healthy shine to your pet's coat. The bristles also won't scratch like nylon or metal alternatives. The LA Beauty Labs Bristle Brush is built with reinforced boar bristles. These are soft without being too weak to properly groom, yet are durable enough to last. The relatively close bristle spacing is great for most types of retrievers, including Labradors, Chihuahuas and Hounds. The bristles aren't too stiff, but provide enough strength for dogs with more wiry coats, such as Terriers. As this is a straightforward brush without advanced features, there's not much more to say about it. The high-quality construction means it'll last a long time though. If used correctly, your dog will love being groomed with it. There are a few downsides though. It's pricey for a bristle brush, so it might not be the best choice if you're on a tight budget. The bristles also aren't strong enough for thick and wiry hair, although for most short hair breeds it does a great job. Check out the description link for more info and latest price. 3. Hertzko Self-Cleaning Slicker For getting rid of tangles, mats and loose hair, a slicker brush is a great tool, and the Hertzko Self-Cleaning is one of the best on the market. It's excellent for almost any type of coat, including short hair, and has an easy clean function to save time after grooming. As you can see from the photo, the Hertzko has a flat head with a matrix of thin pins. These pass through hair to remove mats and tangles, while also removing loose hair, although not as effectively as a de-shedding blade. This isn't just a basic slicker brush though. The head is relatively wide, so you can groom larger areas in less time. It also has a comfortable anti-slip handle and is suitable for all breeds and coats. The bristle retraction button is another useful feature. When pressed, the bristles retract into the head, allowing you to remove caught hair without needing to unwind it. If you've ever tried to pull loose dog hairs from a slicker brush before, you'll know this can be a big time saver. As you would expect from a quality brush, the Hertzko is relatively expensive. Does it justify the higher price though? In my opinion, it's more than worth the money. 
the Hertz Go does a great job of removing loose hair and tangles, as the thin wire pins can untangle deeper hair rather than just the top layer. Each pin is also designed to avoid scratching your dog's skin, which is important for ensuring your pet enjoys his groom. If you're looking for a highly effective slicker brush, then this is my top recommendation, even if it costs a bit more. Keep in mind that the wide head can cause problems when grooming very small dogs or puppies though. You might need to choose a thinner head for the smallest dogs, such as the Lil Pals below. It's also important to avoid hurting your pet when using a slicker brush. Make sure you don't press too hard, as this can cause scratching and discomfort. Check out the description link for more info and latest price. 4. Safari Bristle with Plastic Handle If you're looking for a cheaper bristle brush than the LA Beauty Labs, the Safari is a great choice. It's a simple brush with an easy grip handle, although the bristles aren't as tough and durable as more expensive options. Even so, it's fine for daily grooming of short-haired dogs, especially those with a soft coat. The Safari is a simple brush that's available for a relatively cheap price. It doesn't include any advanced features and it isn't made with boar hair, but has a comfortable plastic handle and is durable enough for light usage. There are a few drawbacks to this brush though. Firstly, it's made in China and the manufacturer doesn't provide details about the composition of the bristles. This is a warning sign that it probably won't be as durable as higher quality products, although this is to be expected from a cheaper brush. The main drawback is that the bristles are relatively soft. This isn't a problem for dogs with soft coats, but it's not suitable for breeds with wire-haired or thick coats. It's also only useful for spreading healthy oils around the skin or removing debris. This isn't a brush for removing tangles. Even so, if you want a cheap brush for daily grooming, perhaps between using a slicker or de-shedding brush, the Safari could be a good choice for soft-coated dogs. Check out the description link for more info and latest price. 5. Lil Pals Slicker Brush if you're looking for a cheaper slicker brush than the Hertz Go, the Lil Pals is a great alternative. It's a smaller brush, so it's only recommended for toy breeds or puppies, but it does a good job of gently removing tangles and loose hair. The Lil Pals is a highly rated slicker brush that does a great job at maintaining a healthy coat, and it's also cheaper than many alternatives. Who should buy it over other brushes though? As I mentioned before, the Hertz Go self-cleaning, which is my top recommendation for a slicker brush for short hair, has a large head compared to many slicker brushes. This is great for medium or large dogs, as you can groom large areas quickly. It's too big for the smallest breeds or many puppies though. For this reason, the Lil Pals is my top pick for toy breeds or puppies. It has a smaller comb head, so it's more comfortable for small breeds and easier to maneuver. The stainless steel pins are also flexible and come with plastic tips to avoid scratching your pet's skin. This is an important feature, as not all brushes include rubber or plastic tips. Like most slicker brushes, the Lil Pals is suitable for most breeds and coats. While short hair breeds often don't suffer from mats and tangles, at least to the same extent as long-haired dogs, a slicker brush is still useful for combing the undercoat and removing loose hair. Without wanting to labor the point, the Lil Pals is very small. While this is a good thing for small breeds, it would be too slow to use on medium or large dogs. The handle is also relatively small, which can make it uncomfortable to hold for long periods. Even so, for smaller breeds with short hair it's a great brush. It's safe when used properly, easy to clean and the perfect size for small pets. The pins also cut through the top coat and help remove any tangles in the undercoat. As with all slicker brushes, make sure you're careful when grooming with the Lil Pals. The plastic ends of each pin helps to protect your dog, but if you press too hard it can still cause discomfort. Check out the description link for more info and latest price.